Hey y'all, I'm Marsha. Today we are going to learn Love Love, choreographed by Joe Thompson Szymanski and Scott Blevins. 32 counts, four walls, intermediate level line dance. The song is Wet Tennis by Sophie Tucker. It um, has not a restart, but a place where we jump to the third eight count. And we'll talk about that as we go. It also has a fun little thing where the last four counts of each 32 can be different depending on what wall we're on. So I'm going to start off by doing a one wall count through and then we're going to come back and break it all down. Okay, here we go from the top five, six, seven, eight, one and two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight. One and two and three and four, five and six and seven, eight. One, two and three and four and five, six, seven and eight and one, two, three and four, five and six and seven, eight. Okay, that was wall one. All right, here we go. So we're starting with our weight on our left. We're going to do a cross side and bump our hips back, and we're going to end up at the diagonal. So we cross right over left, cross, step left kind of back, and then drag and bump those hips back. Okay, so that's one and two. Ready? Here we go. One and two. Then we're going to lock step to the diagonal, stepping on our left, three, four. Then we're going to do a pivot turn. It's kind of a chase turn with our left foot. We're going to go left, right, left facing six o'clock okay <clears throat> that is five and six and then seven eight is a full turn two halves you can also just walk walk sometimes that's helpful when you're learning the dance or if you don't want to turn so from the top again we're going to cross with our right so it's cross side bump step lock left right left and now we're going to do that half turn my left shoulder goes back half and it goes back again half and I'm facing six okay section two is a zigzag section okay it faces six o'clock so I'm going to turn around so you can see my feet <clears throat> it starts off and we're going to do we're going to use the diagonals we're going to step touch to the diagonal step touch and then to the left side step touch and then the next step squares us back up we're going to go right together right forward okay and then we're going to kick our left foot kick back rock recover and that's syncopated and then a step right pivot okay let's look at that again again we'll be facing six o'clock but we're going to do it this way S diagonal step touches one and two and right together right kick back rock and step pivot turn okay so let's do that to six o'clock starting with our right one and two and three and four five and six and seven eight okay now we're back to 12 and we're going to do a wizard step. We're on section three. So a right wizard, one, two, and, and then we're going to place our left three and swivel our heels and four. Okay. Then we're going to do a ball cross, ball cross, left, right, step left to the side as we're making a quarter turn and we're going to pony back with our right, seven and eight. Okay. Let's do that section again. It's a wizard. We're going to start with uh, our right foot, and it's one, two, and three. Swivel, hip, swivel, swivel, ball cross, step, pony back. And my weight is on my right. One more section. We're going to do and touch. We're going to come back a quarter to the 12 o'clock wall and touch, and then step towards three. Then we're going to do a left shuffle or a left triple, left together, left, and that's three and four, five, six, seven, eight. This is our section where we can do different things on different walls. Wall one, we do hip bumps. So we go five and six and seven. We lean on to seven on our right, and then we drag back for eight. Okay, if 
5 and 6 and 7 8. So let's do that last section. We just did our pony back and our weight is on our right. We're going to go and 1, 2, shuffle 3 and 4, 5 and 6 and 7, 8. Okay? So now I'm going to do wall 2. We're going to start over with our cross side bump. So here we go. Cross side bump, lock, step, pivot, turn. Now our half, half, half. Now our zigzags. Right touch, left touch, right, left, right. Kick back, back with a pivot, turn. Okay, now our wizard. One, two, and three. Twist, twist, ball cross, step, pony back. Last section and touch step left triple and this time we're going to do paddle turns we're going to get around in three counts all the way around so five six seven jump eight okay now we're ready for wall three here we go so we jumped back our weight's kind of on our left one and two three four Five and six, seven, eight. One and two and three and four, five and six and seven, eight. One, two and three and four and five, six, seven and eight. And one, two, three and four. This is nine o'clock. We're always going to do a paddle turn here, okay? five six seven eight and also when we get to nine o'clock every time this is where we leave out the first two eight counts and we start with the wizards so that's section three we come around from the paddles and we still do the last 16 counts so we're going to go one two and three and four and five six seven and eight and one two three and four and when we get back to 12, we always do hip bumps. 5 and 6 and 7, 8. Okay? Always paddles at 9, always bumps at 12. We've made it around one time. Now, at 3 o'clock, when we get to the 3 o'clock wall, the second time we do paddles. And the second time we get to 6, we do bumps. So, 3 o'clock and 6 o'clock are the walls that change. 9 o'clock is always paddles when we face 9, and we always jump to the third 8 count, which is wizards. We always do the bumps when we're facing 12 o'clock. And that's really the whole dance. So it's a lot of fun. Those bumps and those paddles fit the music. So once you listen to the song a few times, I think you'll understand why those walls are choreographed that way. If you want to pop over and watch the demo and dance along with me, I think that will help. And I hope to see you soon on the dance floor.